on player two. Hmm. No. Okay, okay. Is there no point, Kula? Here for John? Yeah, Interesting. I feel like I've seen so much Kula that now I'm curious to see what he does with Rock. Yeah, I uh, I wonder like what is going through people's minds uh, when they decide some of these team order things. Because like Johnny, obviously we've seen him play the point Kula against other players. So it'd be it, it'd be cool to know exactly what the decision making process is. I mean, they could actually have played each other before, and they just like that matchup against that player. Yeah, that's probably it. Mutual jump CD, trying to catch some stray hits. Johnny, not known for overextending. Gets the jumpy cross-up. Diablo backing off. Mm -hmm. Diablo taking some pointers here from Johnny's uh -oh. performance on the last. I knew it! <laughs> I knew it! Because uh, I was okay. like, there's no way. There's way yeah. too much deep hits from this. <laughs> this way too much right. defense from this cooler. Alright. I'm like, wow, this is, I was like, Diablo's cool is backing up <laughs> a lot. It's yeah, yeah. Biting off of Johnny's style here. That was crazy defense. I'm surprised he managed to block all of that. Yeah, that was nuts. Again, full screen. Nice EXDP though from El Diablo. I think that secured uh, him the lead. Oh, not anymore. Oh, every pixel matters now at this point. Five seconds remain, and that what beautiful space. Just goes to show you how much control Johnny has over these matches. As it seems, everybody he's played on stream so far, he's been able to bring the time down to almost nothing. Mm -hmm. Like, it's not a coincidence at this point that he's been pretty effective with this gameplay. Yeah, absolutely. Definitely a con conscious game planning decision that um, Johnny is always trying to execute. Nice. Wow. Great DP. Oh, Diablo yeah, keeping himself in this. Johnny, again, look at this. Look how far back he is. The breath. I mean, in the in the long term, right? It, it is to Johnny's benefit that Diablo gets the least possible life back. Yeah, you know, and that, that is technically a win for Johnny if Diablo would have let it trickle down all the way down to zero. Mm -hmm. It's just a long game. I wouldn't play because I can't play like that. It's just sure. jarring. It's like. <laughs> But he's so good at it that even Diablo had to respect it. Ooh, that was almost so nasty. Nice throw. Oh, okay. Diablo now on the back foot. The 2B is there, man. You, you gotta consider it in these cross-up situations. Yeah, it's so hard to keep that in mind. Is like you're so used to jumping at certain spacings against e literally every other character. Yeah. Nice punish on that. I don't know if he noticed, but Johnny used a lot of guard cancel or a lot of meter to guard cancel in that match. Yeah, that's true. Very committing, very committed to just not giving a clean look to the opponent. Yep. That goes to show just how much faith he has in his own neutral. Oh, nice. what? Paid in front. Ugh. I don't even want to ask if he knows how to intentionally do that, man. I, I just, I just want to hope that the game just happy accident. Out yeah, yeah, yeah. Wake up buttons. I respect that, Diablo. All Giving right. yourself an opportunity to make a comeback. Oh and that, that is something that Bijanet has afforded. Yeah. Can that it seemed like a, on you at any point? That, that seemed like such a Garo interaction where she would like backdash and hit mm -hmm. you with that. 
at moments that you're not expecting. That's wow. nasty. That, that mid screen mix up is so nasty. It's, she has everything, man. Like, she can explode on you at a distance. She has ridiculous buttons. And God forbid she gets a knockdown uh, mid screen. That is a really nasty mix up she has. Mm -hmm. A Johnny seven. up one. Yeah. And again, this is loser semi, so it's going to be a first to two. Diablo has to win this next game to keep himself in. All right. Johnny and that signature teal Kula. I believe that's the color that uh, ZJZ won Evo with. Oh, just outside of range of that too. Oh my God, I was about to say, if that comboed, Johnny's a genius. Wow, stayed in front. So ambiguous. We're seeing Johnny now taking the fight to him. Yeah, this is, it's like a different player now. Yeah. All right, El Diablo. Finding an opportunity and now quickly disengaging. Oh, that was almost very dangerous there for Johnny. Mm -hmm. 2B blows up the potential cross up there. Yeah, he's back to playing like kind of or uh, normal standard Kula. Um, so I guess it might just be like a player matchup type of thing. Burned a lot of meter doing it too. Mm -hmm. Did a lot of EX race spins. There we go. And, and you know, made use of his ability to be able to back up and play against, uh, play with the back against the wall. Mm -hmm. um, worked a lot of that time down. Yeah, for sure. Oh, the other fine. Yeah, that was. I can't believe that he gets a combo. I say that every single time, but. Yeah, that 2B was so far, too, right? It's like not even just the jump in, it's just a 2B hit from that distance. Right. So dangerous, yeah. even with that little piece of life, and Diablo's able to take it out. Yeah, he's got to be happy about that. Johnny uh, doesn't really get much of an advantage off of that strong point battle that he won. Mm -hmm. B. Jeanette, a threat at any point in time with the EX Harrier at any distance here, potentially right plus. There it is again. Oki, that's super strong. Oh, it gets thrown out of it, though. Yeah, he's yeah, staying alive. Next one in there low. He's all willing to commit to getting away from that. Oh, connects at the last second. Unbelievable. Again. Rolls into another TV. Wow, that was so dangerous. Oh, oh, wow, finally gets connected. He's gonna get punished for this play style. Oh my gosh. And that's, that's what it takes to get on top of this lead against Johnny. It's the one touch, and now we got a different match on our hands. Mm -hmm. El Diablo, I feel like the game plan now is to just try to lame it out as much as possible um, and force Cronin to approach. Uh, hopefully get the, the timer below the 42 seconds. Like, wow! Goes right in. Oh no, drops the combo. Oh man, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Yeah, those situations right there is difficult to decide. Should I burn this meter to get this damage and get this knockdown for a potential of even bigger lead? Or should I just save it and whittle down the time and for my anchor to have more meter? Yeah. You know, at Evo, I was talking uh, with Free and L, and he was, he was telling me that he was talking to some of the East Asian players. Uh -huh. One of the things that they noticed about our play was that we spend meter without really thinking about it uh -huh. um, on our second characters quite often. Apparently, that 
their their philosophy is a little bit different. They like to try to save meter for their anchors um, if they can, you know. Well, that makes a lot of sense because even with their Cronins, uh, I forget specifically which Cronin it was, but they always had Jump CD into Climax available. Mm -hmm. Right. So, which hits OTG for anything. So, damn. Okay. Good job there from Diablo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those differences in philosophies. Um, you know, they still have their successes. It's not like it's you know mathematical or scientific at this point because you see people have successes um with the different ideas yeah but it's just interesting to see how they play out for sure and that's another reason why i'm looking forward to so uh looking so forward to some of these future upcoming events mm -hmm. um such as evil japan we've been talking about this all night but like mm -hmm. it's gonna be i think the next big uh stage for uh, international type of event yeah that part of the world is going to get an opportunity to shine in a very different way and in person as well yeah. which is not something we've seen <laughs> feels years ago at this it, point dude tell me about it i definitely felt like at that time i was a much younger man <laughs> like <laughs> that's a different dude back oh, then. sure yeah yeah for you especially mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, anyway so true, yeah. back Johnny versus El Diablo. It's a 1 1 tied up set. And again, the, the loser of this is out of the tournament. So they are both playing their hearts out. I honestly don't know where to call it, chat. I don't know where you are with this. Who do you guys believe in? Do we got a Johnny fans? Do we got Diablo? I cannot call it whatsoever. And that's simply because of how different a playstyle these two represent in this matchup. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Look at the pressure that El Diablo is putting on. Johnny wisely makes some space and is able to reset. And again, there's the combo that you can't believe that hits. It, it hit me in the exact same way it did last time. <laughs> Always, dude. Jump back D. Fade away. Oh, All right, the beautiful. counter. Very nice. Absolutely beautiful. Just outside of range of getting caught by that stand CD. Mm -hmm. Time working its way back down, almost at 10 seconds. Nice. You gotta make a bet at some point, and that was a really good point of the match to do it. For sure, El Diablo uh, taking the first round, but by a skid of his teeth. Mm -hmm. The exterior again, gotta be careful. Could exhibit some plus frames in that situation. Got the EX overhead though. Beautiful. So scary how she could just let that rip so quickly. Uh, can even get like really great punishes on things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you said it's very reminiscent. Of the character is very, very reminiscent of uh, Kim from like. Uh, well, I was gonna say 13 and 14, I suppose. Um, yeah, that's true. Beautiful. No DP that time. Oh, oh connects at the last second. Blocks the cross up. Diablo's ready. Good defense so far. Wow. Runs into a stand CD. So far, this. Okay. Oh, Finds a hit. Baby. Oh my gosh. Gonna get the OG. Super scary. What are we gonna do? Nothing. Just stays there for a second. Yeah. Scared of the DP, I think. Nice EX. Yeah, that'll do it. All right. Diablo is starting to normalize this matchup. Johnny's playstyle isn't having as much success as it did before. And Diablo is on a pretty big lead to make it into a uh, loser final. Mm -hmm. When people start getting those types of throws off, you know the pressure is really good. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Gosh, the counter hit again, and so ready is Diablo. That's nice. That That's definitely maximizing the opportunity. Mm -hmm. Oh, not close enough to get that punish on the roll. Johnny trying to make something happen. Has meter to not going to kill, but 
create another opportunity. There it is. This should kill. Lovely. That was good. That's exactly what he needed at that time. Now we've got El Diablo's Kula. Yeah, and Johnny's in a position where he's got to be aggressive here. You know, so far in this match hasn't been able to really exhibit to being the most elite at um, offense. Definitely strength has been the defense and keep away game. Yeah, that's for sure. And even right now, I feel like it's hard to say that it's true because he's getting opened up by a lot of different things. Oh, oh just early enough. I can't believe that connected. This is a match. We got a match. Oh, oh no. Cross up. Not a full conversion, though. So that was an expensive guard cancel. Oh. oh doesn't matter. Good stuff. El Diablo moving on. And uh, a bit of a nail biter. Yeah, that was. Uh, that was a, a trip, man. Um. Johnny definitely testing the metal of these KOF players right now at the, in this top eight and seeing if adjustments can be made this late in the game. And Diablo showed uh, some poise there and being able to turn that around. 